Hi, Jason West here from jasonwest.com and now I'm going to show you how you can send out an email to your list, a broadcast email using Kartra, a very, very simple emailing system. So first of all, we go to My Campaigns and then Broadcasts and then we press the green button down the bottom here that says Broadcast so you can see how it's kind of easy and then I'm going to call this uh, Demo Broadcast. And then you get to select a category. So if you're sending tons of emails out, it's nice to categorize them. And um, I'm just gonna put here a new category. Why not just put a new category for you? And I'm just gonna put this Kartra demo. And then we can select that now that we've done. So here we go, demo broadcast, Kartra demo. So I'm gonna create a brand new email and this is how we do it. You get to choose with Kartra if you want to send SMS as well, by the way. So if you're building up a database of people and they've, you've got their phone number, fantastic. You can also send SMS through the system too. But I'm just going to send an email and I'm going to just leave everything as it is. You get the choice to change the sender name. You can change the send from email as well. So that's a, a really nice, quick, easy way to do stuff. So let's just do that right now just to show you. like that and then click save and that's using Kartra's inbuilt mail system which by the way uses SendGrid which is a really good reliable email system so the deliverability of this email is excellent and the speed at which it gets sent out is almost instantaneous is really really good um, so now you need to choose your recipient so you would go to your uh, email list that you've got and you can choose to so many different things. You can email everybody who's in your database or only people who've opened a particular broadcast email before or they haven't opened it before. There's so many options. You know, received a previous email but then they didn't open it, uh, has clicked on a link in a particular email or they haven't, uh, subscribed to a list, not subscribed to a list, has a tag. There's so many different things. Look at all these options here. So you can be ultra specific with who you're about to email in one hit using Kartra. So I'm just going to put for the purpose of this, uh, let's put has, well let's put everybody, no we're going to put subscribe to my list. Okay so I'm just going to put my list here and then just click add. So everybody who subscribed to my list which I've only just started like a couple of days ago, as you can see 135 leads are there and 135 people are gonna receive this email if I pressed send. So I'm gonna to go to the next bit. And now this is the part where we actually start writing the message that's gonna go out. And you get the choice here to do one email or you can do an AB split test. So what does that mean? Really easy, you can create two emails and then you send one email to so many people in your list and then one other email to the rest of them in the email list. And then we can see which one gets the most open rates and click through rates if you've got a link in your email. So it's a really good way to make sure that you're getting the most out of sending these emails. So I'm just gonna click one email for the purpose of this training video. And here we can see we've got dynamic variables. That's a scary sounding name, but don't worry. All it means is that you can personalize the email with uh, data that you hold about that person. So for example, their first name, you just copy this variable by pressing Command and C if you're on a Mac or uh, Control and C on a, on a computer or right click and just press copy. And so if you want to, you can put it in the uh, subject header here. So if I just put, you know, hi and then first name, there you go, that is now gonna replace first name with their name uh, that you have in the database of your email list. So that's really good. And obviously if you don't have their first name and you've just been collecting emails only, then that's fine. Just leave it as, you know, hi or whatever subject line that you want. And there's a few more down here that you can see. You've got, you know, IP address. I don't know why you'd want to put that in there. But uh, postcode, city, uh, country, and all kinds of different things. So a lot of options in the way of dynamic variables. And if you want to, you can just uh, close this list back up 
somehow. Uh, what's going on here? Let's just switch to advanced. There we go. You can just usually just move that up and down if it's in the way. Now with basic, you really do just have like a basic email editor, which is actually fine for most people, to be honest with you. You can link things in there by selecting the text and clicking on this link and then choosing to you know type in whatever you want to do there. So that's all very simple. Um, this is what you call a WYSIWYG, what you see is what you get uh, editor. So you can just type out whatever you want there and that's how it's going to look, dead easy. So if we switch back to advanced though, now you can start doing some really fancy things such as changing the background of the email uh, to a different email uh, color, a background color. There you go, you can see that's gone red now and it's showing you what it's going to look like or changing the canvas color, which is the color around the main email. So God knows why you'd want to do it, but hey, if you wanted something really mad like this, then you can change that. So I'm just going to change that right back to white, and perhaps we will choose to have a, a light blue. Why not? There we go. And now you can choose from some preset templates that Kartra provides you, and you can see them here. There's some really good templates that have been laid out for you to save you loads of work. And all you need to do is just change the text within them. And if you want to delete certain parts of them, you can do that as well. So they try to make a load of templates for different companies, different scenarios uh, that you can use. Like there's one with a nice dark background and a video, for example, if you wanted to send that. You can always up upload your logo to the top of the emails to brand it in your own thing. And if you want to change any colors, you can do that too to your own brand. So it's dead simple. You can see these emails look really, really nice. And in fact, what I'll do is I'll just drag one over because this is all, all you have to do is drag it to there and let go. And there we are. That's it. You've now got a really nice looking email template that you can personally change around. So if I want to change this logo up here, I would just click on the edit symbol and then just upload the logo of choice just there and then where it would link to. And you can control the size of it by using this. So very straightforward. You can see how you don't have to be a web designer to make a decent looking email. Same for this image. If you want a new image there, no problem at all. Just go ahead and upload a new one. So that's really good. And then button links as well. If you've got a button in there, you can change what it says on there, as you can see, and then put in the link and change the background color even of the button if you want to. So this, uh, it's very, very simple to do once you know how within Kartra. Um, and you've also got the opportunity to create your own email up from sort of half done blocks. So over here, you can see you've got headlines. So we can choose like a nice custom headline. I'm going to drag that over like this. There we go. You can change the text dead easy. And then you've got other things here as well. So you've got your text in different layouts. If you want a list of things, you can do that too. And then content wise, you've got all kinds of these different content blocks, which are going to be brilliant for you if you've got like a product or something you want to show off. So let's just drag one of these over just put that there like that very nice and there's lots of different ones and so many different ones here look at all these different templates uh, you know how long is this gonna save you in time it's gonna be fantastic and then um, underneath that we can just add an image of our own choice we've got a whole range of different buttons as well we can add in nice and simple uh, headers so we've already got our sort of header there we don't really need to worry about that but there's lots of different ones hero sections which is similar to this but this looks really nice let's just dump that in there there you go how cool is that and you can change this image so don't worry you can change this background color look at that just get it get it gone there you go if it doesn't suit your company colors or your branding then just change it to to what works for you and then moving down a little bit more some more hero sections designed for you to you know put for apps and things like that if you're selling apps call to action everyone needs a good call to action in their email maybe you've got a pricing template you want to drop in let's just put that in above there you go so if you're doing web hosting or something like that you can uh, easily have your pricing structure 
beautifully laid out. And countdown timers. Now there is a whole load of things you can do with the countdown timers. So I know for example, there's a lot of other email uh, marketing software out there where you know you don't have the inbuilt timers. But with Kartra, you can just drag one across and then you get to choose how it's used. And this is where it gets very, very clever. You can have it unique to every person. So as soon as they open the email, a counter starts. You can have it by a fixed date, say in three days time, this counter runs out. So if you're running a special offer, you can have it, you know, this offer ends in three days and this starts counting down. And when they go to the buy now page, like the sales page or even the checkout, you can have the exact same timer running on that page. So that's a huge thing, you know, it just carries on and, and just carries on with the exact same time. So they get to that landing page and they still see that time is running out, which gives them a reason to buy now. Very important. A sense of urgency. If you've got testimonials, you've got some lovely layouts here for testimonials. Let's drag one of those over, look. There you go. Really nice testimonial template there. Lots of different layouts and then at the bottom you've got footers so if you want to add in all of your social stuff let's just drag that down here right the way down to the bottom of the email bing there you go and then you can edit each one of these icons to just put in your url go into your social um, pages like your facebook and twitter and so on so that's how easy it is to create a nice email once you've got it looking perfect we can just click send and next now with the automations, you've got a, again, a whole load of opportunities here. It's mind blowing really what you can do. So if the lead opens the email, we'll just click add. And then in the then section, you get to choose what happens if they open that email. So for example, one thing I like to do is give points. So let's give them 10 points if they open this email. You can make the points even expire. So maybe they open this email, but you know they're not opening any other emails. Then we can just expire these points after say 10 days. And if you want to, you can just do nothing and just click add and then we'll save that. So now we've given them 10 points if they've opened this email. We can also give them points if they click on the link within the email and it can be any link or a particular link within the actual email so for example the buy now button and then we can as i say give more points we can do all kinds of different things but if they click on a particular link in email i'm going to give double that i'm going to give 20 points and then click save so there's a huge amount of things that you can do within Kartra that's way above you know normal email marketing software now if you're not ready to send it save it as a draft if you want to schedule it to go out on a different day, you can do that. So say even in a week's time, if you want to. Um, now it uses Eastern Standard Time. So if you're in the UK, that's like five hours behind. So say you wanted to go out at uh, nine in the morning, then that would be like 4 a.m. So you just click 4 a.m., job done. Um, and if you're ready to send it right now, just click on the send now, press save and next, and it is gone. So obviously I don't want to do that because I don't want to send that crazy email to my list they'll think I've gone mad. But that is how you send a broadcast email uh, using Kartra. Um, I used to use MailChimp. I used to use MailerLite. I used to use uh, ActiveCampaign. I used to use ClickFunnels mailing system as well. So I've had a go with all of them, you know, all of the major ones, Aweber, so many of them over the years. But I really like this system because you can see the amount of flexibility um, that you've got when you send a broadcast. And if you want to keep it dead simple, you can too. You know, you can just put click everybody in my database, blah, 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 blah. Here's my email, um, you know, bam, send it now. So I've just shown you a lot of different options, but you don't have to use them all. So I hope you found that really useful. If you want to try capture out uh, for like a dollar, then you'll be able to click a link. Uh, within this post, this email, wherever you're seeing this video. And if you want to subscribe to more stuff from myself, if you're not on my list already, visit jasonwest.com and uh, I'll be happy to send you more cool training videos, which hopefully will be really useful to grow your business online. Thanks for watching, guys.